All right, we continue. The Nelson Mandela Foundation says that the United Nations Deputy Secretary General Amina Mohammed will still deliver the annual Nelson Mandela Lecture. Controversy has erupted following claims linking Mohammed to the illegal export of over a million precious rosewood logs. Mohammed, a former energy minister from Nigeria, is accused of irregular, uh, irregularly authorizing export permits for the precious wood. Nelson Mandela annual lecture series is a prestigious event graced by prominent individuals from Africa and beyond. The lecture series invites prominent people to drive debate on significant social issues. From Africa, previous speakers include former South African President Thabo Mbeki, Archbishop Emeritus Desmond Tutu, also from South Africa, and Liberian President Alan Johnson Sirleaf, to name but a few. On the global stage, luminaries including former UN Secretary General Kofi Annan and Microsoft CEO Bill Gates have taken center stage. Africa's dominance of the series continues in 2017, with United Nations Deputy Secretary General Amina Mohammed headlining its 15th edition. Despite Amina Mohammed's alleged involvement in the illegal export of rosewood, the Nelson Mandela Foundation says she will still deliver the annual Nelson Mandela Lecture in Cape Town next week. The, uh, the, 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 the scandal that has uh, broken, and uh, we've also noted her response there too. Uh, she indicated that uh, she did nothing wrong, um, and, uh, and she will be investigating herself uh, what could have gone wrong. Um, we were, we were encouraged by her saying that uh, she, she abhors uh, corruption and will do anything in her power to ensure that uh, we are free of corruption. The former Nigerian Minister of Environment has been identified as allegedly playing a major role in the clearance of over 10,000 containers of illegally harvested logs of timber. The shipment is said to be worth 300 million U.S. dollars. Dumalo Moshaudi, SABC News, Johannesburg.